Hey everybody, how's it going? Today we're going to be going over and showing you how to install the Stromberg Carlson base pad RV levelers. So our kit components are going to be composed of the rubber mat, our leveler here, and then our wheel chalk. It is available in both a quantity of one for your single axle trailers and a quantity of two for your tandem axle trailers. So if you find yourself to be camping on a nice flat level concrete pad a lot, then chances are this product isn't for you. But if you're like anyone else who frequently parks their trailer on a gravel driveway or just simply the grass, you're definitely going to love these levelers. They are very easy to install and they're adjustable all the way from a half inch to up to four inches. So the reason this is important is when you're parked on those uneven surfaces there, your trailer is going to have a lot of rocking back and forth and it's definitely not going to be as stable as if you were when you're level. So having a means to level your trailer on any surface is really going to be a great feature that you can add to your trailer to improve your overall camping experience. So something else I like about this kit that sort of sets it apart from some of the other options is again, it comes down to everything we're going to get with it. So we do get this nice rubber pad here, which is going to serve as a cushion for our levelers when we're on those harder surfaces like gravel, but it also serves as an anti-slip device. So normally if you're on a gravel surface and you try to drive onto these levelers, chances are it could slip out from under the wheel there. So you're going to be fighting with it a little bit, but having that nice little anti-slip surface there is going to ensure you do it right the first time. So in regards to capacity, these things are made out of a plastic-like material, so they're not metal. So you may not think they're as strong as metal, but that's actually not the case because these levels here are rated for up to 30,000 pounds. So you guys aren't going to have any issues at all with weight capacity. So there are a couple different levelers on the market, some of them very similar to these, but Stromberg Carlson actually has a nice interlocking mechanism between the leveler and the wheel chalk here. You can see it's going to be much more secure. And when we're not using the levelers, we can still use our wheel chalk to secure the trailer. So we don't have to keep extra wheel chocks along with our levelers in the trailer. We can just keep this set here and it's going to have a dual purpose. So last but not least, you'll be happy to know that everything in our kit is made right here in the USA. So you know you're getting a quality product. So we have our wheel chocks, we have our rubber mat here in the center, and then over here we have our actual leveler. So we'll start off by taking our rubber mat here and we'll be placing it just a few inches in front of your tire. Now we're gonna take our leveler here, looks like this. We're gonna flip it over. You're gonna place it on top of the rubber mat there and you're gonna wedge it in between the ground and your tire, just like so. Now we're gonna be getting in our vehicle and pulling forward, which is gonna bring the tire up over the leveler and hopefully our rubber pad stays in place and keeps everything from slipping out. So we've got our trailer pulled forward here up on our leveler. So right now we're at the max setting, which is four inches. So we're pulled pretty much all the way over the leveler. However, you can actually adjust this system to have anywhere from a half inch to four inch of leveling capability. So if this is too much for your particular application, you would just simply back up a little bit more and you can always back up and pull forward until you get the sweet spot to get your trailer level. But once you are in that setting, we're just gonna take our wheel chalk here just go ahead and slide it into place there under the back of the leveler. So we have this installed right now on a single axle trailer, but the installation is actually going to be pretty much the same for your tandem axles. We're still going to be placing our levelers and our pad in front of the front tire, but we're also just going to be replacing it in front of the rear tire as well between your two tires. You should have enough room to do that. So again, it's pretty much going to be the same. We're just going to have double the components. So now that we have our trailer where we want it, that's pretty much gonna do it today for our look and installation of the Stromberg Carlson Base Pad RV Levelers.